Hello. The time has come, the walrus said, to talk of Illumicrate unboxings. This one is the October box. I'm really losing track of the months at this point, but yes, this is the October box. This is Revenge's Sweeter themed. I know what the book is gonna be. I'm very excited. One of my most anticipated releases for the year. Let's have a sneak peek. And as I said, Revenge is Sweeter is the theme and I'm very excited for the book and everything else inside this box. So let's dive in. The first thing I see here is a little tin that says the Convergence Honey and Cinnamon Candle. Ooh. Ooh. That's interesting. I really wouldn't think of putting honey and cinnamon together, but it's quite nice. I was about to hold it out for you to smell, which clearly that's not gonna work. It's just plain inside. It doesn't say what it's made of, but that's okay. And it's a cute little tin. How sweet. Off to a good start, aren't we? Then we have this <gasps> measuring cup. Okay. Let's get it out of the plastic. This is so cute. So these are measuring cups for the kitchen. So we have a quarter cup, a third cup, a half cup, and a full cup. And I'm guessing these are Caraval themed given the artwork on the bottom. I think it's the same on the bottom of each one. Yeah. But I do actually use cups like this quite often when I'm cooking because a lot of the recipes that I follow online for Japanese food in particular are measured in cups. So super useful. Then we have our next mug. This is Deal With The Devil, designed by Rosie Thorns, as usual. I don't remember what fandom this is supposed to be from. It is super pretty though. That's really pretty. I really like that a lot. So nice. And then we have this, which I presume is another one of those uh, pouches that you put stuff in. Wow, Sophia, really excellent describing there. It says, I am made of memories, Madeline Miller. Very pretty, very pretty. And then if you fold over the top like that, it's white on the inside. And then you open it out and it's a little book pouch, often used for TBRs and such things. I now have, I think about three of these. So, uh, I don't know that I necessarily need another one, so I might, um, might rehome one of them, but these are super, super useful anyway. And my battery light is flashing, so I'm just going to swap to a different battery before it dies. Okay, I'm back. So we only have the book and the pin left, so I will show you the pin first looks like this very very pretty it looks like a phoenix almost really really nice really pretty i always really love stacy's pins i may or may not have quite a lot of them <laughs> um and then oh actually hang on we've got an art print first of all very nice, very nice. No idea what it's from, but 
it's nice. It might actually be uh, which is steeped in gold because I'm sure that one of them has kind of white hair in that book. I haven't read it yet, but I think so. And then we come to the book. So let us see what it looks like. It is Iron Widow by Ziran J. Zhao and it's got some really nice foiling. This is the spine, the back, stencil sprayed edges blank on top at the bottom. Uh, we have a signed book plate for this one. Oh, and she's used the Chinese characters, I love that. And ooh, ooh, underneath the dust jacket we have some foiling, very pretty, it says you've been living a dream for long enough, welcome to your nightmare. Yay. <laughs> What's wrong with me? And then a reversible dust jacket also, there we are, very pretty. And as I mentioned, this is one of my most anticipated releases for the year. It sounds incredible and my battery light is flashing again. So very briefly, you've been living a dream for long enough. Welcome to your nightmare. The boys of Hoxia dream of the celebrity status that comes with piloting chrysalises. Giant transforming robots that battle the aliens beyond the Great Wall. Their female co-pilots are expected to serve as concubines and sacrifice their lives. When 18-year-old Zeishan offers herself up as a concubine pilot, her plan is to assassinate the ace male pilot responsible for her sister's death. This was a great box, loved it. Don't forget to check out Ponderful Books down in the description. That's it for this one and thank you so, so much for watching. If you like this video and want to see more like this from me, then do think about hitting that subscribe button and I hope to see you here again soon. Thanks, bye.